Hey guys, I will show you how to fix this problem on Windows 11 system. So this solution is also applicable for Windows 10. You have to just follow my screen and don't miss any steps. Okay. So in the first step, uh, we will uh, update the drivers. So you have to just right click on the star icon and select the device manager. And once we are here, we need to expand the network adapters. And for the particular device, you have to right click on it, select properties, then go to the drivers tabs and select the update drivers. Make sure you are connected with your internet connection. So select the first one, search automatically for drivers and the best drivers will be installed on your device. So close all windows one by one. Now uh, again. Go to search bar and type your task manager then click on run new task select browse button now go to this pc open c drive then open windows folder now open system32 folder and here find out cmd.exe file so here it is you have to keep scrolling down until you find this file so select it and click on open now check this box and click on ok on this window we have to execute the two commands so type all these commands carefully and hit enter to execute them type in any et sh space pin soak reset and hit enter then type in netsh space int ip reset space reset log dot txt and hit enter and type exit then you have to just uh, go to the services so go to search bar and type here services and click here to open it once we are here we need to find out the wlan you have to just scroll, keep scrolling down and find out the wlan auto config right click on it select properties and make sure you have to set startup type as automatic then click on apply and then ok and start the service now close this window and restart the system that's it guys don't forget to like the video and please do subscribe the channel and please check out the pinned comment that will also help you to fix that issue